Hey guys, Jason Mackey here with your One Minute Penguins update for Thursday, November 12th. The team practiced earlier at the UPMC Lemieux Sports Complex in Cranberry, but I forgot to film this, so shame on me. I'm filming it here from my home office. But in any case, a couple things to take away from that practice. Matt Cullen, Evgeny Malkin, they missed maintenance days. I wouldn't expect it to be any big thing. Mike Johnston basically said they're under the weather. Mark andre Fleury, he practiced... Had a cut on his face, you know, obviously that he suffered on Wednesday night. Kind of an interesting story, a, a tragedy narrowly averted, if you will. But he practiced fully, no big thing there. Um, out of the locker room, the big talking point for me was Chris Letang. Now, he's going to be paired with Ole Mott on Friday, at least for, Mike Johnson said, about 15, 16 minutes of the game. I think they'll do pretty well together. They have a history, played well together in the preseason. Uh, Ole Mata's conditioning wasn't quite at the level where he could hang with Chris Letang, basically because of, you know, a bad season for Olimata last year, shoulder surgery again, all that stuff. Well, they're going to be back together. I would expect Ian Cole to play with Rob Scuderi, Brian Dumoulin, and Ben Lovejoy. But Letang was very interesting. Uh, he was interesting talking about the Andre Markov hit from Wednesday night that went uncalled um, and basically admitted that he went after um, Paul Byron in the neutral zone, shoved him, and it was an interference call, but it was basically retaliatory on Latang's part. Uh, there's been a little bit of talk, and I was the one that asked Latang about being a minus 11. There's only two worse in the NHL. Now, I know as well as anybody how stupid of a stat plus minus is. I'm not trying to, you know, hang my hat on a minus 11 or, or think that a minus 11 is, is that big a deal. Now, I think the bigger underlying issue, uh, scoring chances for, scoring chances against, as the Penguins think that. Now, throughout his career, Latang, his scoring chances against usually around 26, and it's about 30 this season. It is high. He's giving up more than he ever has before. The golden question is why. Uh, you can kind of peg it to being with Ian Cole, a new partner, any of that stuff. Um, I think Chris Letang just also needs a couple games to get some confidence. Things have not gone his way. He admitted to me at Edmonton that you know he was adjusting to playing with Cole. He's adjusting, basically, to playing without Paul Martin. I think, if anything, it says how valuable Paul Martin was to the Penguins. Now, I don't think it's any cause for concern in a big way, uh, but I do think that the Penguins want to see some solid games out of Chris Letang. It's why they're pairing him with Ole Mott. I do think that pairing will work well together. We'll see you on Friday. For your one-minute Penguins update, I'm Jason Mack.